India, 500 million farmers, 1.1 billion rice eaters, all of them potential customers. We need someone they can believe in. Dr. Linda Watt, don't let her youth fool you. I've got some good news. We're sending you to India. Me? Yeah. I'm Dr. Linda Watt. Linda, I will be your government rep. I've never done anything like this before. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> Any questions about rice, you just let me know. What does she know about farming, huh? This is how we making hello. <laughs> a traditional greeting. Linda, I want you to meet a village elder from the shrine. Greet him. Oh. <laughs> Amused? A little bit. Kind of. <laughs> Rajit was always top of his class. Impressive. You should stop by my lab. Wow, so this is what an American rice paddy looks like. Please put this on or go outside. Oh my God, are you serious? You know your rice is going to have to grow outside. It's called Mother Nature. There's flowers. People walk around barefoot. <laughs> What's up? It's about that wonder rice of yours. It's sterile. Linda has no idea, does she? Whatever you can think of to do, do it. Well, we have to do something. If you think some big agribusiness is going to look out for your best interests, then you're crazy. Take that rice to the train. We need to stop the train. Okay. <sighs> the train of progress will not be stopped. Don't think I've been here before. I think you're really going to like it here, Doctor. India is this exciting journey. That shine on both of us. Welcome to my office. You must be very important. Oh, very. <laughs> you know, you've got some really good moves. You must have been Indian in a past life. <laughs> You're cute. What an unexpected night. <laughs>